And part of your product lineup, of course, includes Bill Gross, the rock star fund manager, Dick, who you brought over from PIMCO. How big of an asset is someone like Bill Gross in attracting money now that the company is larger and globally more diverse? Bill is terrific. Bill is probably the best uh, fixed income manager of my lifetime, uh, the number one best fixed income manager out there. Uh, but he's reached a point in his career where he's not looking to run another firm or manage a big department. His focus is on leading his product forward, his global unconstrained bond fund, and making sure those investors get an excellent risk return result. He's done very well. He's attracting positive flows. I think that will continue. And uh, he also brings uh, intellectual uh, life to the firm. He brings the ability to teach clients about what's happening in the market. He brings macro insights. And these are very valuable for us and our investment teams, but they're also extremely valuable for our clients. So he contributes to the whole in a lot of different ways, and we're very lucky to have him. Forgive me for asking the obvious question here, though, but a lot of people had mentioned after you bought Velocity shares back in 2013 that there would be a Bill Gross ETF soon. How come we haven't seen one yet? I think uh, when you talk with Bill about how he wants to allocate his time, he gets to make some choices at this point in his career. And so far, he has not decided that that's how he would like to allocate yeah. his time. And I'll support that. Um, Bill, if you're watching and you want to launch an ETF, give me a call. <laughs> but uh, at this point, we'll let Bill lead us in terms of what he would like to do and how he'd like to allocate his time.